The detention of migrants is a multi-billion dollar industry. One in which immigrants are traded like products. They are for sale to the highest bidder. Who benefits and who profits? Corrections Corporation of America, or CCA, the GEO Group, and the Management and Training Corporation combined own over 200 facilities in the nation. With over 150,000 bed spaces for a total profit of close to $5 billion per year. Private prisons profit like a hotel. The more occupants that go in, the more money comes out. You just sell it like you're selling cars, or real estate, or hamburgers. Private prisons rely on anti-immigrant laws that guarantee them access to fresh inmates. Here's how they do it. The American Legislative Exchange Council, or ALEC, is an extreme right-wing membership organization comprised of state legislators and powerful multinational corporations, including the Corrections Corporation of America. ALEC is the most active private prison lobbyist group, pushing for anti-immigrant laws like Arizona's SB 1070. Russell Pierce, like CCA, is an ALEC member, one with obscure ties to national white separatist neo-Nazi groups. During an ALEC meeting, CCA and Pierce crafted a model legislation that became, almost word for word, Arizona's SB 1070. Whether people are undocumented or not doesn't matter. As long as they fill the detention facilities for days, months, or even years. SB 1070 and their copycat laws sprouting up across the country represent the perfect money machine. Thank you.